In this video, we'll look at ASP.NET. ASP.NET is Microsoft's framework for building web applications. You can program ASP.NET pages and forms using Visual Basic, and the syntax is then encoded as HTML. We'll go to File New Project, and this time we'll choose an ASP.NET web application. Change your name, location, and solution name, and choose OK. We'll choose an empty template, and OK. Then to our application, let's add a web form. Add new item, web form, change your name, and choose add. It takes us to source view, and this is the HTML or markup view. You have two other choices, split view, half markup, half design, or design view. I'm first I'm going to add a text box from my toolbox. And then I'm going to add a button. Now let's take a look at the source view now. Here is my code for the text box, and here is my code automatically generated for my button. I'm going to run this, and notice now my run is giving me a choice of browsers with my default browser selected. When I run this time, it runs in a web browser. my text box, my button. Now it may not stop even when you close your browser, so you may have to click Stop Debugging. Back to Design Mode. I'm going to add a calendar. You can add code just as you would in normal Visual Basic. I'm going to double click on my calendar and add some code. I'm going to set my text box. To the value of my calendar. So whenever I select a date on my calendar, the value is going to go into my text box. I'm going to run this. So using typical Visual Basic code, when I select a date on my calendar, the value goes into the text box. You can also use data source. I'm going to the Server Explorer. And I'm going to take, you can add a new connection if you need to. I'm going to use our Karate connection. I'm going to take our instructors table and add data from our instructors onto my form. I'm going to choose to auto format my grid view. And I'm going to run. And this video was a quick introduction to ASP.NET. 